Good morning, Newcastle, and welcome to NCTV 45's News Watch on this fine Saturday, May 6th, 2023. we got a couple great stories coming up for you, but first, we want you to hear from our great sponsors. If you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV 45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are News Watch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV 45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV 45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV 45, anytime on your time. Special thanks to Butts, Flowers, Gifts, and more in downtown Newcastle for their support and funding of this program. Butts Flowers, downtown Newcastle. If you're hungry, don't be out in the desert. Head on down to the old oasis for breakfast. If you're hungry, don't be out in the desert. Head on down to the old oasis for daily specials. Yes, appetizers, sandwiches, beverages. It's the Oasis Bar. 303 South Jefferson Street, call 724-652-6104. Peppers, mouth-watering fruit, fine dressings, apples, meats. This place looks so familiar. Getting your lunch meat, cut to order. That's the Joseph's difference. They make every opportunity to please their customers. Joseph's. They're not the big box store giving you it the way the store wants it. It's the way you want it. Stop by Joseph's and take a look. Yes, it's Joseph's. NCTV 45, strong enough for Lawrence County. Start you off like we always do with the birthdays. David McLaren, Jackie Perna, Lynn Ann, Sherry Robertson, Robert Mazur, Joseph Withrow, Ralph Pallarino, April Navarra, Alyssa Ann, Vince Sanami Jr., Sandy Dombeck, Gina Morgan, Doug Fusco, Brian Frank, Jamie McKissick, Jenna Bash Bashura Bonjavingo, Gino Parenti, Happy birthday to all you guys out there. Make sure you get that second piece of birthday cake. As for your news stories today, we're going to start you off with a local news story. Coming in April and May to historic Warner Cascade Theater. Saturdays at noon starting April 8th and goes till May 20th will be Looney Noons featuring Looney Tunes cartoons and photo ops with Bugs Bunny at 11 a.m. preceding showings. Each Wednesday at noon, starting April 5th to May 24th, will be a classic Warner Brothers film from their golden era. All classic films in partnership with the Newcastle Public Library. Historic Warner Cascade Theater is located in the recognized historic structure where on February 2nd, 1907, the Warner Brothers opened their very first theater, the Cascade, seating only 99 patrons with chairs borrowed from a local funeral parlor. The venture launched the careers of filmdom's most iconic four brothers. Harry, Albert, Sam, and Jack. The brothers who grew up in Youngstown selected Newcastle as their starting point for their venture due to the success they enjoyed showing Edison's The Great Train Robbery at the Lawrence County Fair. Groups may contact Gary Kern at myshowroom at yahoo.com or 724-510-4226 for additional information or to schedule private tours. We're going to head over to the Cedar Sports Corner Report and take a look at Around the Sports World for your Saturday and maybe a little sneak peek into your Sunday. We'll be right back. 
The Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle, 724-658-9543. That's 724-658-9543. It's great anytime. Try their breakfast and you'll be satisfied. A pierogi cheeseburger, an Italian Joe, and smothered hoagies. All. Oh, and don't forget the French fries with chili. Yes, it's Lindy's lunch for the best. Stop by. Give us a call. Hello and welcome to the Cedar Sports Corner Report. Let's take a look at around the sports world for your Saturday. As for your NBA matchups, we've got two pivotal Game 3s for you. Both are on ABC. At 3.30, the Miami Heat will host the New York Knicks. And at 8.30, the Golden State Warriors will make the short trip to L.A. to take on the Lakers. Now, friendly reminder, both those series are tied up at 1. This series is 1-0 in favor of the Vegas Golden Knights as they will host the Edmonton Oilers in a crucial game too. That is at 7 o'clock on TNT. As for your MLB matchups, big slate for you. The Detroit Tigers go to St. Louis to take on the cards at 215. The Chicago Cubs will play host to the Miami Marlins at 220. 410, we got two games as the Rockies go to New York to take on the Mets. And the Tampa Bay Rays, the best team in baseball right now, will play host to the Yankees. At 6-10, the Minnesota Twins go to Cleveland to take on the Guardians. At 6-35, the Batlin Bucks will play host to the Toronto Blue Jays in a pitching matchup that will feature Jose Barrios for the Jays and Johan Oviedo for the Battle and Bucks. 6-40, the Cincinnati Reds play host to the Chicago White Sox. 7-10, the Oakland soon-to-be Vegas A's go to Kansas City to take on the Royals. Three 7 games, two of them are on Fox. Baltimore goes to Atlanta to take on the Braves. Depending on the location where you are at, you will either get that game or this one as the Boston Red Sox go to Philadelphia to take on the Phillies. Depending on location will be the blackout restriction rule. More than likely, we'll get the Philadelphia Phillies game. At 7:15, the Milwaukee Brewers go to San Francisco to take on the Giants. At 8:10, the Arizona Diamondbacks play host to the Washington Nationals. 8:40, interdivision rivalry, as the LA Dodgers should go to San Diego to take on the Padres. That could be a future playoff matchup, as Dustin May will go against Blake Snell. At 9:07, the LA Angels will play host to the Texas Rangers. And at 9:40, the Houston Astros go to Seattle to take on the Mariners. That's all we got for you today. Why don't you head over to the Cedars? Catch out all these great games. Enjoy the great food. Take a quick time out. Thank you. Alley's Upper Crust at 1700 Highland Avenue has a full menu. Pizza, roll-ups, salad, soup, sandwiches, strombolis, dinners. They are just great for dine-in or take-out. Don't forget to give them a call at 724-652-7553. It's Alley's Upper Crust. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Los amigos! Ladies and gentlemen, if you need a 
good bite to eat. Make sure to check out Los Amigos. They got you covered with things such as tacos, burritos, poco gente, and don't forget the great chips and salsa they put out for you when you get there. Make sure to check out Los Amigos on West State Street, Newcastle, PA, 16101. It's Los Amigos. Los Amigos, Los Amigos! Little different segment here, your national holidays for May 6th. National Free Comic Book Day. Iconic publishers like DC Comics and Marvel Comics join forces to make free comics available. International No Diet Way. No Diet Day, excuse me. International or er, National Nurses Day. That one is not international. Beer Pong Day. Childhood Stroke Awareness Day. Dr. Mark Grow Cardiatric. Surgeon Appreciation Day. That one was a tongue twister. Herb Day. Drone Day. Join Hands Day. My favorite Kentucky Derby Day. Joseph Brackett Day. Naked Gardening Day. National Aiden Day. National Beverage Day. National Bombshells Day. National Crepe Suzette Day. National Explosive Ordnance Disposal Day. National Fitness Day. National Scrapbook Day, National Start Seeing Monarchs Day, National Tony Day, National Tourist Appreciation Day, National Wildfire Community Preparedness Day, Pilots Day, and National World Ancus Losing Splendidus Day. And I probably definitely botched that. Excuse me for that one, but... <laughs> I have never heard of that one before. So, make sure you get a free comic book. Make sure you enjoy some great food. Maybe throw a few herbs on there. And maybe fly your drone today. As for your other news stories today, from the governor's office, the Shapiro administration announces all Commonwealth agencies take critical step in approving licensing, permitting, and certification, certification processes. Today, Governor Shapiro announced that all Commonwealth agencies under the governor's jurisdiction have completed a comprehensive review of their licensing and permitting licensing certification and permitting permitting processes, a critical step in the governor's mission to make government work efficiently and effectively for Pennsylvania residents and businesses. PA workers often wait months and are forced to to navigate inefficient digital systems to receive their professional license, permit, or certification. And Governor Shapiro knows this must change. That's why, in one of his first actions as governor, the governor signed an executive order to improve response times and give Pennsylvanians more certainty when they apply for licenses, permits, or certif certif certificates. Through the Commonwealth, applicants who do not receive a response in a reasonable time frame will receive a refund of their application fee. The review cataloged more than 2,400 total processes, including 750 licenses, 800 permits, and 36, 360 certifications issued by the Commonwealth agencies under the governor's jurisdiction. The Department of State issues the most, issuing more than 1,000 permits certifications and licenses followed by the Department of Environmental Protection. Previously, this catalog of license permits and certifications across the Commonwealth had never been assembled. Under the governor's executive order, agencies had 90 days to compile a catalog of all the licenses, certi certificates, and permits they issue, including the statutory authority governing the time they must process applications and the application fee charged by each agency. As of May 1st, all Pennsylvania agencies covered under the executive order have met the governor's deadlines and completed this process. Now, the governor's office will review, analyze, and establish efficient application processing time for all occupational permits or licenses based on agency recommendations. Once those recommendations are put in place, if an agency does not respond to an applicant, the agency will refund the application fee. So, Another great story from the Shapiro administration. We're going to head over to Orange County 45 weather. Take a look at how the weather's looking for your Saturday and into next week. We'll be right back.
Yes, friends, Chalella and Carney Floral Designs is alive and well in Newcastle. Owner and designer Stephen Doherty and his staff have a special motto. We love what we do, and it shows in every area of the business. Stop by their pleasant Southside store at 1006 South Mill Street. Chalella and Carney has been there for the community with quality and service since 1943. You can go to the website, chalellaandcarney.com, or call 724-652-8412. Since you were going for gas, you might as well fill up your tank too. Delicious food available at Morgan's. And that's just two exciting combos that they have. Morgan's, right across the line. restaurant. The Crane Room is a bar. The Crane Room is a banquet facility. The restaurant will please you time after time with their diverse menu. Ask about their daily specials. See the menu at craneroom.com. The bar gives you an abundance of choices with 35 beers on tap and always changing. Their banquet services are always to perfection. The Crane Room located at 3009 Wilmington Road in Ashanic Township. Call 724-656-1553. Hello and welcome once again to Lawrence County 45 weather and a little frosty last night as uh, we get an overnight low of 42. How is your weekend looking? Well, take a look at the courthouse, the sun beaming off the dome right there and the local radar, nothing to talk about, national radar Showing you clearing, Ohio, Indiana, Illinois. You know, you got rain around Oklahoma, but that's not going to get to us now. We're going to enjoy some sunshine. So here you go with this forecast and get that sunshine out today up to 71. Mostly sunny. Winds will be from the east slightly and some things aren't going to change as Sunday. You'll get sunshine again. And uh, a nice high of 76. Now, let me go back a second. Partly cloudy Saturday night, a low of 44. And Sunday night, partly cloudy, a low of 50. So the overnight lows are going up. The temperature during the day going up. Now, uh, let's take a look at your Monday. Your Monday sunshine keeps beaming as you get up to 77. Monday, slight chance of rain in the night, mostly cloudy, low of 54. That chance of rain goes up to 40%. Now, when you get to your Tuesday, you get an outside chance of rain of 40%, and that persists with us through Tuesday night. Partly cloudy, a low of 54. And then your Wednesday, sunshine continuing and up to 73. 
Now, uh, not too shabby. As you get to Wednesday night, partly cloudy, a low of 48. And uh, your Thursday, sunshine again with a high of 73. As uh, we'll take it, 73, 74 will be the flavor of the day. And uh, there you go. I'll up you a degree. Now, uh, that was Lawrence County 45 weather. We're going to take a look at the weather chart. And then move on to these great sponsors. It's sunny. Get out and visit them. If you're in need of great baked goods, perhaps donuts of every kind, or maybe a lady lock is your desire, turnovers, and don't forget, they have cakes of every size, quarter sheet cake, or a round one for that special birthday. And never forget to pick up a loaf of bread. It's Kimmel's. Home of the delicious, super mouth-watering strudels. Call Kimmel's for the best baked goods. Hi, pizza friends. You can still find delicious Augustine's Pizza at your local supermarket. The folks at Augustine's Pizza hope that their pizza is always your first choice for any and all occasions. We're going to finish it off here with your local events for your Saturday. Cinco de Mayo Ride at Mines and Meadows ATV Riding Resort, 1307 Old Route 18 in Wampum. Tickets are sold online. The event is open to the public. Celebrate the traditional Mexican day here at Mines and Meadows. Find as many bead stations as you can. The more colors you find, the bigger the prize. Turn your colorful beads in by 5 p.m. for some great prizes. Our food vendor will be here with some great Mexican sandwich and visit the link online to buy and purchase tickets as for another local event for you live music at nc eagles club cherry radium cherry radium will be at the eagles club saturday may 6th open to the public check us out on facebook the event is open to the public and this is at 43 south jefferson street in newcastle pa as for your another local event at the night tracks presents blues attack for over 25 years, Blues Attack has been an integral part of the Pittsburgh blues scene, playing at amazing festivals and clubs all around western Pennsylvania area and beyond. Originally fronted by the amazing Jill West, who passed away in 2021, the band honors her legacy by continuing to play with passion and soul. Blues Attack is known for its guitar and harmonica-driven sound that mixes blues and rock with country elements, creating a genre-bending music style of their own. Please join them for a night of high-energy blues and rock. Come have a Blues Attack. Blues Attack's new album, Five Day Struggle, can be heard on all music platforms, as well as on the band's own webpage. CDs are available at all live shows by contacting us at bluesattackpgh at gmail.com. This is at Night Track at 5095 West State Street in Edinburgh, and the event is open to the public. Open Mic Night at Riardo's Bar and Grill at 1207 East Washington Street in Newcastle, PA. Hey, so there's your four local events for your Saturday. Make sure you try and get out and attend one of those. There's some great ones going on for you. So we're going to head to a quick break, and we'll be right back to wrap you up. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's Community television station at our law firm we see you come see us at lgkg.com
And welcome back. Thank you for tuning in to NSYNC TV 45. Just a friendly reminder, we're available anytime on your time. The train that runs on your schedule, why that's NSYNC TV 45. Make sure to tell a friend and have a friend tell a friend about NSYNC TV 45. They'll be glad you did and they'll be glad that you told them to check out the multiple program and different programs we offer. So have a great Saturday, everybody. We'll see you again real soon.